All right. Um, I'm in the woods in St. Louis Mission. Uh, it's a city park in Tallahassee. Um, coming this morning um, with my dog. Um, but we're entering a time of people going after one another in every way, shape, and form. Um, some out of desperation, some out of trying to protect their image. Uh, and, um, and there are biblical references to this. It says that God didn't come to bring peace, but to bring a sword to separate. However, I know that God is one of love and he wants to save as many people as possible. Um, but how do we get along with people who we don't agree with, um, who we um, don't see eye to eye with. Um, and we have a lot of great references in the Bible um, and of uh, people living their lives. Um, and um, we're gonna be persecuted. I mean, that's, that's a fact, um, especially in this time um, where false prophets are going to increase tenfold uh, the great falling away is about to happen. Um, I've heard about the triggers that are going to cause it, but um, the great falling away will happen. Um, and so, <clears throat> um, biblically speaking, I mean, it says if you have anything against your brother, and the brother is, is in reference to, like, your, if you will, Christian brother, um, it also means your brother, brother, but um, in the Bible, it does make reference to um, that mom will go against child, dad against daughter, uh, sister against brother, and all that thing in this time. So your brother is actually um, a person of Christ. Um, and what they did in the olden times um, is, is that's where the fish example came in, uh, where they did a line um, in the... Like they would, they would uh, draw one line and then the other person would draw the other. And that would be a, a, a symbol of um, Christian beliefs. Um, but we have to lovingly come alongside these people um, <clears throat> and try to, in different ways to get them to see the light. Um, and I've heard um, different people um, John Paul Jackson was as one of them that was a preacher and Toby come back Sorry, my dog's wandering off. Toby, please come here uh, My dog is down the trail um, but um, like um, He talked about like a higher power and and um, how the higher power could change your life and so I think as Christians in the body of Christ we have to talk to them and see where they're at and just get to know them and if they're willing and open just talk about like a higher power and um and i mean go into the religious stuff and um just try to lead them to god um but we will get persecuted i mean look at all the apostles especially uh paul is especially a one where he uh was put in prison and um lashed uh like 30 to, uh, or like four well he was put in prison like between 30 and 50 times i can't remember the exact number and we may not have the exact number and then he was also whipped and beaten and scourged many 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 times um and on a side note it's like what makes these people different and want to do this um because i have a hard time i mean it's like i have a hard time opening up and trying to put myself in that shoes and um, I mean, there are times when it's like, okay, well, I'm, I'm going to heaven. And then there are other times where I blow it big time and, um, just sin and do things against what the Bible says. And so, but we have to lovingly be near these people. And God says to try to lovingly show the example. Um, we have to lead by example. So no matter what people do to us, we have to, um, show God's love and not, um, reciprocate. God says to, um, like if someone tells you to do something, um, also, um, like if, if they ask you to go one mile, go with them too, kind of thing. 
And they also say if um, if they ask for your coat, um, give them your your other part as well. Um, but um, we are to. Um, I mean, you can always turn the other cheek and go the other way. Um, and I would um, have an exit route if you can and um, talk to them and try to be there for them. But if they're not willing to listen, then you did your best and you move on. Um, you can also pray for those pe the people that you're trying to get to before and after and, and just try to get their ho hearts open. Um, but there's going to be people that are desperate for, for food and for money and for all kinds of resources. And they're um, going to be on a different level, if you will. And they're going to um, need things and they're not going to be of right mind, if you will. And so um, we just have to be very cautious. Um, but just um, we can't lash out against these people. We can't, I mean, unless they put us in and, and we're having to defend ourselves, we are, uh, we should go the other way. We should turn the other cheek and we should not, um, battle. Um, I do believe there will be riots as well as civil war because, um, I believe our voting systems are rigged big time. Um, and that's already been proven with a press, past presidential race. However, God puts people who he wants and uses who he wants so um, there is that but God does not want us involved in the civil war he wants us to forgive forget and move on and if you have anything against anyone that means political people that means other people then you're to, you're to forgive them and if you're in a if you're watching something or doing something that sets you off then you should stop doing that immediately like TV used to set me off if I watch a program or something that is um, it, it sets me off and puts me in a worse mood and so I start thinking about it and doing stuff and so you need to just um, not be that way <clears throat> um, and what I also do <clears throat> in order to handle these situations more is I get outside with that guy um, who's my dog and we go to parks and um, I mean yes this is not the greatest of parks and places that uh, I mean yeah there are other places I wouldn't mind being uh, but I, we're in a time where uh, you have to take what you get and um, just enjoy what you have. Um, and this is what I'm doing. So, um, but I've learned to work out those frustrations in a more better way. Um, I go running, I go work out. And, um, if, and there may be a situation where you're living with the person that you don't agree with. And you have to try to um, lovingly go um, talk to them and try to show them the truth and show them. And I would show evidence. I would show them. It's like, hey, here's scripture on exactly what what we're talking about. Because there's many people. Um, imagine living 30, 40, 50 years and uh, believing in something and. And it not being, well, I, I mean, not believing that it's right, like uh, Mormonism or Buddhism or Hinduism, and they're, they're spending 30, 40, and 50 years, and they're going, and um, they're, they're searching, and they're, they know something's not right, but um, that's all they believe in. I mean, people are, uh, we're definitely creatures of habit and um, like to do things a certain way. Um, Toby, come here, please. Um, but um, I mean, it's even harder with some some groups. I, I know if um, you switch from like Muslim to Christianity, uh, they excommunicate you. And I think there are other religions as well. But they they throw you out the door immediately. Um, they say, okay, well you're 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 not mine anymore, and they throw you out the door. Um, so um, yeah, so it's harder for them to change. Um, but um, we just have to live differently um, and try to have routes um, out and we also um, I know during the week we, we may be in a work situation or um, other thing and we have to just put up with these people um, and that's what God wants God wants you to um, 
to be around these people and try to lead by example and no matter what they do if they curse you or run after you or uh, put you down or I mean that's the devil coming after you and wanting you to fail and wanting you to curse them and and hate them but we're to uh, lovingly show the way I'm now walking sorry <clears throat> but um, we are to live differently we need to pray way more uh, we need to be in the Bible way more and to um, <clears throat> <clears throat> yeah, just um, live differently. Um, but yes, the Bible definitely says if you have something against anyone, to forgive them and move on. It says to love your neighbor. Your neighbor may, <laughs> may curse you to your face. So um, we're supposed to love everyone um, and not hate everyone. Um, there are people that it's very hard to. Maybe someone took your, your son or daughter or did something very evil to you and and God wants you to forgive them and that's hard to do. Um, but we are not to, you can defend yourself in this time and you can uh, walk away, but just be uh, cautious and... Toby, come here, please. Sorry, my dog's running after, he loves squirrels. Um, but, but anyway, just, um, Toby, come here. Toby, come here. Come here. Sorry, my dog's running away from me and towards a, a major road. So, um, but, uh, but no, uh, we need to be in the Bible and make sure that we understand God's word and understand where he wants us and what he wants us to do. Um, but yeah, um, we also have to be in a mindset that we can deal with all the craziness. Um, and also the Bible points to a time where we're supposed to run and get away. And that time is fastly approaching. Um, so if things go belly up and things go really bad real quick, um, I, I'm gonna pack up and try to find a safe spot. Um, if I have to live out of my car, so be it. Um, but, um, but yeah, try to find good in your circumstances. Um, I'm in situations where I've been for two years and I don't like them, but I'm dealing with it. So, um, but thank you for joining me this morning. And, um, I mean, this is a topic that you need to think on and, like how would I deal with certain situations and um, maybe you're you're struggling and you're at your wits end and trying to figure out how am I going to pay for, for different things there are good people still out there like myself who want to help so um, ask God for help and guidance and to do the best you can um, thank you for joining me uh, God bless you all um, stay the course and don't get involved in a civil war that's coming up.